Assalamu alaikum brothers and sisters. I hope you are well. What's the biggest lie you have ever heard or you have believed without even objecting or you have convinced yourself even though you know that it's not certainly true? You probably are thinking about a file of things. Well, I think one of the biggest lie ever this generation or the earlier generation had been taught is men and women can be friends without having any additional intentions. Well, I'm not here to tell you what's haram and what's not. That's not my area to talk about. But we generally can discuss and benefit from this. Now, all the college men and women and even teenagers out there think like, Islam is so hard, man. All rules. Everything is haram, man. I can't enjoy my life. Well, I understand these ideas and thoughts because I do have lived that type of life. Wallahi, Islam is the logical and beneficial and the best thing that has ever happened to me or even you or anybody. Ask those people who revert or who start practicing in unpracticing environment. So brothers and sisters, can men and women be only friends? I want to present a very logical non-Muslim perspective. Watch this clip first. All of my friends are men. I don't have female friends. I don't. I'm, I'm incapable. Why? What do you mean? Well, because you know, come on. Because you have a wife. Well, I have a wife, and I don't, I don't really have female friends because, look. Okay, let's get rid of this. <laughs> I want to know why. Okay, I'm gonna tell you this. Let's get rid of this right now. There, you, you're an attractive woman. There are some guys somewhere saying, "Yeah, I'm. We're friends." No, that's not true. He's your friend only because you have made it absolutely clear that nothing else is happening except this friendship we have. We remain your friends in hopes that one day there'll be a crack in the door, a chink in the armor, and trust and believe that guy that you think is just your buddy, he will slide in that crack <laughs> the moment he gets the opportunity. Because we're God. And you think most men think this way? 99.9% uh, .9 of us think that way. And you tell this to a woman and it just blows her back. No, I have male friends. You have male friends because they know it can be nothing else right now. I tell you what, all your male friends, just ask them in a friendly way. If if I wanted to date you, would you be okay with that? And watch, watch the fireworks. <laughs> watch. Masha Allah, some real truth has been spilled. Are the sisters shocked or brothers convinced? You can let me know in the comment section. We read all of them. Steve Harvey, most of you might be familiar. He's an American television host, actor, writer, producer, and comedian. He hosts the Steve Harvey Morning Show and many others. I don't really watch these, but few of his clips are motivational, aren't they? He told the truth in the English language. Did you get that? Well, one thing I want to say is, maybe your intentions are good, but you can never know what the other person is thinking behind his mind. You can't read other guys' mind, can you? Probably, we all can wish to read others' mind to only know what a human mind is capable of. Honestly, think about, are you genuinely being friends with someone? Please don't waste your time on such things, which are nothing but heartache and headache. It's shocking, Steve Harvey don't have female friends, and he even told the reason. He's talking about the fitra of a human nature. Islam segregates gender for a reason so you are protected and not misused. Islam prohibits friendship with opposite gender. It's for a reason. But movies promote this nonsense like crazy. They just want to make money out of it. And they change your view because mind believes what it sees. So brothers and sisters, please be careful about things you are watching. So how do you deal with it? Learn to have respectful, decent conversation with opposite gender if necessary. Dua is ibadah. Take out some time in seclusion with Allah and tell him what's bothering you. Ask Allah for halal and ask Allah to make you overcome your desires and problems. So brothers and sisters, can men and women be only friends? Just being honest? No. This is the lie we are fed and we ended up believing to a certain extent. Brothers and sisters, I hope we are able to present this topic without disappointing you. That's it for today. I hope you liked the video. Let us know your thoughts in the comment section below. We would love to hear from you. Hit the thumbs up button. Subscribe to the channel. Turn on